developed your shoulder mobility, you have the grip strength now, and you learned how to develop some momentum. Today, we're going up onto those monkey bars, and I'm gonna show you how to actually change heights. My name is Maggie B. ATC, and I am the OCR trainer. Welcome to Training Hack Tuesday. Regardless of the race series that you're running, there's a good chance that they're gonna switch up the monkey bars on you and they're not just gonna be straightforward. So how do you train for those increasing and decreasing heights? Well, OCRaholics, I'm here at my favorite local park and I'm gonna show you just how I like to train. Let's get going. Now when you're talking about changing heights, it's really just us talking about momentum. So, go back, watch last week's video on momentum if you haven't mastered it yet. Otherwise, find your monkey bars and start swinging. Once you have good momentum, drive from your hips and your shoulders to increase that height. Come down to the next one and do it again. So it all comes down to driving from that hip. Now if your park doesn't have a monkey bar set where you can actually increase that height like mine do, get onto your normal monkey bars, but try skipping bars in between. Skip maybe two, three, that's going to give you enough momentum to teach you how to change heights. We love hearing from you. Use the hashtag TrainingHackTuesday on Instagram for your feature.